Hey everybody, it's your girl Key to the City and you are watching the Deadly Grind online. I'm here today at Ben Franklin High School with Dream Chasers First Lady herself, the lovely Lee Mazin. And we're here at the Blackout Tour. She's promoting stopping the violence in all of not just the schools, but the communities as well. So uh, Lee Mazin, tell us a little bit about the tour that you're doing. Well, I actually put it together last year. But um, to get it clear about the board, we had to actually show them what we was trying to do. So I attacked schools individually. Ben Franklin actually came to me. So it was like, okay, so since they came, we decided to, to build the tour around this school since this is one of the biggest high schools. But my whole motive behind it was basically, I came up with the whole blackout idea around my next project, which will be dropping sometime on the top of next year. But I wanted to do something big around Black Friday and Thanksgiving. And when I was elaborating on it, I thought of blackout. And when you usually think of blackout, you think of something negative, even all your lights going out or somebody just spazzing and losing it. But I wanted to flip it and make it mean something positive. So my definition of blackout is going as hard as possible in a specific task or your interest, basically going to your maximum capability that you can go and just pushing and nonstop. Trying to push that to flip the meaning or the perception of blackout so i created a blackout tour we're going to start off with just high schools and then we're going to spread it as big as it can go so how many schools are going to be in a tour do you know as of yet not we don't have a specific number right now i got five schools locked in and we plan in the building not even just philadelphia we're going to hit the jersey region all the way down to virginia and really you know try to speak some motivation into these kids absolutely so it's so good to hear because, you know, every time you turn on the news, you hear something negative. So yeah. it's someone with your talent and your influence to actually go out in the community and spread something positive. Yeah. So I definitely commend you on that. Thank what you. do you hope that the kids can actually take, you know, from these tours that you're giving? I'm, I'm re very realistic. I don't come here and put on the front. I just be me and I be comfortable. And I walk in these shoes. I walk these same streets that they walk. And I, I went through some of the same battles that they go through. And I'm going to talk on all those topics so they could really feel like I'm not just somebody speaking what they want to hear, what they supposed to hear. I'm going to speak what I went through. And that I, I know what y'all going through. I know the struggles. I know how hard it is to get in college so nowadays and how hard it is to stay out of trouble and stay grounded and stay focused in school. I've been there. So I, I know what it takes and I know, you know, how hard it is. I want them to know that they're not alone and it really can be done because I did it. I did it and I went through some of the same battles that they went to, went through. So that's, that's really, really amazing. Um, I thank you so much for your interview. We definitely will continue to support you in this tour. You know, we'll revisit this to see how it's going. And then if you go somewhere else, you definitely let us know. Of course. Thank you. So thank you. Make sure you check out the dailygroundmovement.com for all the information on the Blackout Tour. Well, make sure y'all hit Comments Tape in my own lane. It is on that piff and leemazin.com. You can grab it from there, too. Bye.